with us. So, first of all, Happy New Year. Um, we start 2019 with uh, a draw against Tramir. So we'll get him up for us. Uh, you know, obviously, um, you know, Tramir, you know, they're uh, flying high, um, doing really well, they're a strong team. Um, and we've, uh, second half, we kind of um, didn't really get into the groove, uh, gave them too much space uh, all over the pitch. Um, I think during the, during the first half, I've kind of changed it back to, say, a 4-4-2 to kind of look at that. And then I think then second half, we were a little bit more stronger. Um, again, we just, you know, once we get that kind of break, we just need to find that, that, that final pass. We get the good positions, we just need to kind of utilise those, uh, those turnovers and um, get our either our wingers in or our centre forwards in a little bit better and earlier. But, uh, you know, it's, it's fantastic draw for us. Um, you know, obviously a sucker blow last week uh, wasn't, <laughs> wasn't too good, but uh, we held on, we did, really we did really well. Second half was much stronger, for sure. You made just the one change from Saturday's game, uh, Jamie Grimes coming in from Nathan Cameron. Mm -hmm. Was that a forced move or was it more of a tactical switch? Uh, I think with Nathan we just have to, um, you know, a lot of games uh, in such a short space of time, he'd be fit for, for the weekend, so he'd be fine. I guess it goes back to what you were saying on Saturday mm. about fatigue, you know, we've had a well, lot of games. Th that's the only place, those are, those are the positions that I can rotate, that's yeah. the only <laughs> position I can rotate, everywhere else I can't rotate. <laughs> um, the visitors certainly made us work hard, particularly in the first half. Kieran made a few yeah. uh, great saves there, but mm. uh, how pleased were you with the defensive resilience of the whole team? Really, yeah, not just. The I think for us, um, you know, changing it to you know um, second half as well, uh, uh, tactically was uh, was uh, was was better for us, and we we're kind of more comfortable with their um, breaks and the, their midfield didn't have as much time and, and uh, space on the ball, which they did a little, a little bit. And um, I just kind of, you know, like set, half time, I just told the guys to kind of shift around, get a bit tighter, and then we can kind of, you know, close down those uh, players when they kind of come off the centre half and uh, close their area to operate in. Because first half, we kind of backed off and gave them far too much um, space and time, especially in the first half. Uh, you know, the first 25 minutes of the first half. But uh, uh, after that, we were pretty solid after that. And, uh, you know, Tranmere's a they're big side and, um, and we're, you know, we're fighting for every point. And uh, that was a big, big point for us. That was good. The lads put a fantastic shift in because we can't rotate the team too much because <laughs> that's it. Uh, and a lot, some of the lads have done a fantastic shift. You mentioned about giving Tremmy a little bit too much space than you would have liked. Mm. Um, with, with that in mind, they obviously took the lead just after the half-hour mm. mark. Yeah. Would you have liked it to get a little bit more closer to Colin James, or do you just have to hold your hands up and say it was a great strike? Uh, we, I think first half, we were kind of backing off in every single department. Uh, whether that's a little bit fatigue, uh, and, and maybe the guys kind of try to save their legs in the game, um, maybe a bit of both, maybe a good play. I think it's a bit of, you know, a bit of everything really. Um, but, you know, back end of the first half and all second half, that was um, not a fly and they didn't have the much, didn't have that space operating. We kind of killed that and, uh, and then we kind of controlled the game after that. We, but it, it's controlling the game, but then what we do with the ball uh, to put our forwards in, to put our wingers in. Yeah, we, we had a couple of chances here and there, a uh, bit of good uh, interacting and good play and combinations. But we, you know, it's the last thing we've got to do a little bit more to kind of um, fashion out some chances. We did have some chances, but we just, you know, we we are where we are. But we're working hard, and everybody's working, you know, their, their socks off. It's hard work over the Christmas period, um, but they've done fantastic. The team. Kobe, obviously, you still parity just before mm. the interval. I guess your halftime message was how we were going to go and go on and, and win the game. Irrelevant if you know. Mm. Try me a big side, but you know, we, we need I've, to I've, I've never, you know, try, I, I, I don't really see that. I just see players. Mm. I see, you know, the guys training every, every day and working hard every day. And, um, you know, it gives me confidence that, you know, maybe a month ago, that, that this game is out of sight for, for Macclesfield. I think the guys have improved. I think everybody's kind of got the fitness level up uh, to a, a decent level. There is a little bit more there. Um, I'm a de I'm demanding kind of guy, and I want more from the players. I know there's more in the players, and we'll get there. So uh, there's a lot to work on, uh, but the lads have put a great shift in over the Christmas period, and it goes again. You know, we just got to keep it going. This is everyone's in the same boat. Yeah, so it's January now, as you're well aware. Mm. Can we expect uh, a few changes, uh, a bit of an overhaul to the squad? 
Uh, I think you know it's um, you know January is uh, is um, you know we've got a month to go, <laughs> so there's plenty of time to look at options. Um, and yes, we, we obviously there will be players coming in because mm. we're very light. Yeah. So uh, we just got to get the right players in. That's it. So I'm working hard and uh, speaking to a lot of people. Um, and yeah, we need bodies. Yeah. Will you bodies. be looking at the loan market or are you looking at the main? I market? think we look at everything. I'm gonna yeah. look at everything. Look at everything. I think uh, uh, there's some good young players who could be alone. Um, we've been forced in it a little bit. Like Ponchicelli, he has to go back with a broken foot. We can't wait two months for him. Uh, shame is a really good prospect. It's such just a shame. It knock us, uh, you know, um, turning the grass and he's, you know, cracked his foot. Um, you know, that's a nightmare because he's a really good prospect. So we've got to get some good good loans in, uh, good young loans, and then get some kind of permanent guys in as well at the same time. Just one additional one for me on that subject. So mm. um, you mentioned about players coming in. Um, mm. Can you update us with uh, news of any of our um, players coming back in terms of like from injury, like Danny Whitaker, Callum? Well, Wix, like Wix is back. Yeah. Um, Callum is uh, training, he's getting back. But we're still two, three still weeks. Sure. Yeah, we 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 need bodies. We, you know, this is it. So we gotta get some reinforcements in sooner or later because uh, it's hard for the lads. So, you know, I've been in a situation. You played all those games in such a short space of time. It's uh, physically and mentally, it's a lot for the lads. So uh, we we haven't you know we haven't got the position to rotate. Uh, maybe in defence a little bit. We we can do that a little bit. But um, you know, we're down to the bare bones, and the lads have responded really well and. Uh, Sucked it up and, and um, gave a good performance because um, you know Trump is a hard side. Because you know they're well organised and uh, uh, got, got some good players. Uh, but we we did really well and that shows how far the team has come. Are you enjoying it, song? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying. I'll get. I enjoy it a bit more when I get some players in. <laughs> because it, it is hard. Because you know I I know because you know we can't keep on playing at the same time. Mm. It's hard work over Christmas period. It's hard work and the, the lads have done unbelievable. So. Uh, just need some guys to help them out to kind of rotate, freshen up the side. Um, hopefully, when Smithy comes, it's the second game. So, hopefully, when Smithy comes back, you know, you know, next game, not next game, the game after the next, uh, that will help us up front. Um, but we need bodies in the field. And the next game comes up quick as well, doesn't it? Maybe yeah. On Saturday, here yeah, yeah, against yeah. Swindon. And then it breaks up a little bit. But up before that, it's it's hard work. So the lads are in tomorrow. You know, they're gonna have a nice. Uh, you know, warm down and freshen up and it's all about preparing get going you know ice the legs uh, get lots of kind of food inside you and uh, plenty of rest get your stretching done get your great recovery and um, and go again it's, it's you know it's brutal this uh, Christmas period it's, it, it's hard work has it taken you a little bit by surprise or is it a learning curve the amount of games you've got to play in this, this short no I could have done it before <laughs> <laughs> I've played as a manager though as a manager it, you, know, I, you know when I was to play I used to say to myself well it's hard work, but you, you do. It's all about what you do in your spare time, it, not so much in your in the club. The club will get you right, but it's when you leave the club. It's how you prepare, how you how you kind of um, respect your body, respect the situation you're in, and try to kind of uh, you know, don't waste any hours or any minutes doing something stupid to kind of zap energy out of you. So, you know, hopefully the players are really kind of looking after themselves and uh, and get through it because the minute you go left and right over this period, I mean, it, it just takes you out and then you're kind of gone in 60 minutes and that's no good for us at the moment because we can't move people around. So, um, you know, it's, but then I'm thinking about it, you know, as a manager and a player, it is hard work because we can't rotate. It's hard work for the lads, uh, but they've done responded really well. Okay. Good. Yeah. Brilliant. Brilliant. Thank you.